Okay, so the song is called FNF Let's Go. It's by Hit Kid and Glorilla. I've never heard of these people ever, mm. but they the song came out and they did a video. And the video is like the video went viral. Mm -hmm. And I think the video went viral because the video and the song, but it slapped Lulu, what up, girl? Like yeah. it slaps so hard. So I did a video using the sound because the sound is going crazy on TikTok. When I tell you this song, I came out to the song on stage last night. It slapped so hard, y'all. And I should not like it. <laughs> but I do. What's the name of this song again? The song is called FNF Let's Go. So FNF stands for Fuck Nigga Free. Okay. So the song, like, the song is like, bam. Now I can't think of how it go, but it's like, I'm fuck nigga free. That mean I ain't got to worry about no fuck nigga cheating. I'm S-I-N-G-L-E again, and I'm hanging out the window with my wretched ass friend. Yo, it's that. Wait, is this the video where the chicks, they like in a parking lot with the cars and they holding the baby and all of that shit? <laughs> what video yeah. was this? Yo, I saw that shit. I saw a clip of it last week, and I was like, what kind of ratchet shit? So is look, this? when I saw the video, I was like, what is happening? Then I was like, well, hey, man, uh, this is this is catchy. That I like it. I like it. Shout so out to I'm you, young brother. Sound like, sound like they got a hit. Yeah, it's, 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 it's a hit. Crazy. Going crazy. It's, like, it's a hit. The song, matter of fact, I got you. You got Apple Music? Nah, I'm a title kind of okay. girl. Okay. Oh, it's right FNF. There, it's FNF Let's Go by Hit Kid and Glorilla. Look, Glorilla. I got it up. I got it FNF, up. Got it. Listen, it wow. is slap though. <laughs> 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 I I used it for my Mother's Day video. Slap. <laughs> Don't play it, CP. They'll, they'll flag it. They'll flag us. Oh, sorry. I, see, look, I started rocking. Ooh. Oof. Let me tell you Oof. what, that kid that Kendra came out yesterday and took the world by storm. Bro. That shit. Kendra Lamar is a, I was confused. Is, is it Kendra? Yeah. I haven't sat down and watched it yet. I haven't sat down and watched, I watched it. Yet. it. It's great. I watched it. I like it's a great video. And uh it's some dude I it's just so saw. simple though. Some dude just said um he had a video just like that against a, a green screen. It was just him, once one long shot. And his face was changed too. And he Ooh. said that they, they stole the, the idea from him. Who yeah, but stole? you're not Kendrick. So if you can't do it while being Kendrick, then just like- That's, it up. It, that's basically what he chopped it up to. He was like, well, when you're an independent order, artist, sometimes these things happen. And you know, you just got to keep working and work harder. But he basically said, and he showed, he started the video by showing, um, his video and Kendrick's video underneath it, and the shit did look similar. Well, who here's the thing: Universal Kendrick's hey, Universal. Pat. Hey, what up? What who? What artist are you talking about? Uh, I Kendrick. forgot buddy name. I, let me see if I say the video. But one Kendrick. could argue that that was a parallel thought, not an original thing that he came up with. Because we can take this back to Michael Jackson's black and white video. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's. I mean, when he was you know doing the and switching. You know, faces and stuff. Yeah, it's not a super original idea. Uh, I mean, I get me. I, I guess, I guess, like using yeah. deep fake technology to specifically mm -hmm. do it to a rap song right now would be, I guess, you know, it, it's been done before, but. But I, I would like to see that artist video. So if you know who it is, I would love to see it and at least support it with the view. Yeah. You know. Hey, hey man, it, it, it's looking like deep fake is about to be the new trend. Yeah, which is about to get scary. For real, I've seen some pretty believable ones too. Man, I have too. I don't know. You know, saying y'all see the 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 Nicki Minaj porno one? Mm -mm. No. Man, they. I'm like, I was, I was, I was, I was halfway through meat beat it before I realized it wasn't even her. <laughs> That's gonna revolutionize the porn industry for sure. <laughs> I was like, and wait they don't a minute. It'll help do anything. Like if, a tape, if a tape gets out on me, I'll be like, that was clearly the technology. Mm -hmm. Someone used my likeness. I would never. 
that's gonna be dope for 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 porn. You could literally just do any anything you want. Just like what? Destiny's Child three. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> what yeah. the? <laughs> Actually, I was like, man, I'm putting this damn meat away. This isn't Nikki. <laughs> you were meat fish. Is that what, is that what that's called? Yeah, exactly, exactly. Lulu's Same. back. Hey, Lulu. Hey, sorry. I uh, hey, man, I'm gonna send this to you, uh, CP. Basically talking about what happened on uh, Thursday, unless you already heard about it. What happened on Thursday? I didn't yeah, know. Yeah, what happened on Thursday? A show we had got canceled, that's all. Oh, I heard about oh, yeah, that. Yeah. Oh. yeah, we need to talk. Yeah, I want to talk to you offline about that. Yeah, let's talk offline about that. That's the one, uh, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah we'll talk offline. Yeah, because that made it to the East Coast. Yeah. I mean, you know, fuck shit does that sometimes. You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> that was a hella Republican move though. That nigga pulled a Mitt Romney move, no. I... <laughs> but that's what you can do when you got money, you got a name. You just say, hey, I want to invite my Amen. friends here and talk about what happened earlier this week. But I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I would be remiss if I didn't say this, like, you know, I got a lot of respect for everybody that was involved in that. You know what I'm saying? But sometimes you be so big, you forget what's really going on. And what I mean by that is like, well, right. Like a lot of comedians, that show, um, Crack Em Up at the Comedy Store, that was their only chance to touch the festival and be a part of the festival in a legit fashion. And you know, that's a black comedy night that we throw in the in the comedy store. You know what I'm saying? Us as black people, black comics, like we support that and we so it's like to cancel these guys' night. Some people have flew in town just to do that, you know, just so you and all your rich friends can sit around and talk shit about it's just like if you look at it from a different angle, you know, it's kind of like, ah. Uh, Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, and I'm not saying I like I did get a chance to do some shows at the festival. Mm -hmm. You know, like, you know, and so I'm not, yeah, I was hosting that night, but I'm not thinking about just me. I'm thinking about people like Reg Thomas, mm -hmm. who, you know, flew out to be a part of it. Think about to hear, think about Amanda Seals, who, you know, she did stuff in the festival too, but we were all about the powwow in our own little, you know, we had it was we these are heavy hitters that we were gonna do our own thing. And so I feel like man, that really sucks, man. It's like, you know, mm -hmm. I, I wish that, I wish that, you know, he he would have made them shut down one of them white shows yeah, in the main it's, room it's and did that shit. They I think that would have been, be. been way bigger flex. Yeah, that would have been way bigger the main flex. Room. But, yeah. yeah. Definitely, but, well, definitely could have took the main room. Two other rooms and he could have like, that shit, he could have did that shit at 12 o'clock or one o'clock in the morning and the shit still would have sold out. It still would have mm -hmm. sold out. Thank you, bro. So it was like you could put that shit at two in the morning, people would have still been nigga. There. So I'm, I'm with CP on it. It's like, bro, like you, but it it shows that like you get to a certain point and you don't care about the little guys anymore, like because they're not they're not gonna pay you or that. But here's they're, the they're, thing. They're, here's the thing, though. Dave looks out like you know. So here he paid your ticket that one time. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I think that I think that it's 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 more of a thing about. getting to a level where you're unaware and nobody really can kind of hold you accountable. Like, like I feel like somebody close to him should have been like, yo, you know, you pulling this away from a bunch of young black comedians who about to just, just let you know, if you still want to do it, that's cool. But just FYI, you know what I'm saying? Like y'all did have a belly room last night. You did do the Hollywood bowl four nights or whatever. It's like, it's, you know, like it's some niggas trying to get whatever they can get out of the game for that. So, you know what I'm saying? Now, if you still want to do it, that's fine. But my thing is, yeah, he, I feel like, you know, I feel like, you know, we, we can't. You said what? He's done the show before. He's he's done the crack him up at the end of the show. Mm -hmm. So he knew what he was doing. And I know they told him, like, yo, this is a shells night. And he was like, oh, baby, you know, she'll be all right. Like, and for him to not even call her or let her know, she had to find out from the club, <clears throat> him not even give her a nod, like, out of respect. 
after you've done the show like nine times, you know, took the show an extra two hours and she got to wait there because she's running the room. Like the least you could have did was gave her a heads up and she got to find out, like I could hear it in her voice. If she wasn't at work, Michelle would have been a mess. You know what I mean? Because that was that was foul as fuck, bro. That yeah. was foul. Yeah. So, I don't care. You know, that kind of that, I like everybody. Look at them different. Everybody would hit me up like, "You okay?" And I hate when people do that because then it made me feel embarrassed. Like, though I was fine. I was fine. Now, now, now I'm now feeling I'm not. Type of way. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like now, I'm, now I'm itching about the shit. Like, yeah, wait a minute. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, I just chalked it up to, you know, him being just a little bit unaware. And, you know, just, but to hear, I know you got a different view on it. But, Hell yeah. I take that shit personally. I'll be taking all that shit personally. Niggas be like, I oh, just, oh, you Michael like, Jordan? Fuck that, B. He knew. Niggas knew. Why are you Michael Jordan in this scenario? Like, everything is very personal. Like, I took that shit personally. He wasn't I even talking to me. Per- because, Lou, you, you know what you're doing. You know, oh, you know, I understand. You know the people. They, they I, I'm sure they told them, Leo. Like, oh, you know, such and such has a show this night. You know, we got X amount of people on this show. Motherfuckers that I fuck with had ball tickets. I had like ten people that had ball tickets. Now they got to go through and get their refunds and go through that whole rigorous progress with the uh, process with with the stores. It's like, shit was unnecessary, bro. That was advocate, though. You said what? What you say? Say that again. That was advocate. Devil's advocate. Mm-hmm. I'm listening. You froze her. Wi Fi is booty. Yeah. <laughs> Pat haven't said in 15 store. minutes, but all he said was Wi Fi. Yeah, you booty. froze up. <laughs> I don't know. Is is this the podcast? <laughs> or is this before the podcast? I can't. This, I can't this, tell. Is, this is the podcast. We already recorded. Oh, oh are good. y'all 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 good with saying all of this? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, oh. It's, yeah, it's, it was it's, just like it's in the LA reporter now. It's in the, I mean, the, uh, Los Angeles, uh, something now. So I mean, fuck it. it is what it is. Oh. Uh, you can Keenan start editing from here. Right. We started. <laughs> oh. I just changed Wi Fi. Is that better? Yeah, it's better. Yeah, now. Like, yeah. All right, cool. Line up. Okay. Nah, he's he not bro. He did that. <laughs> why would it make you gargle? You gargle. Like, why would it change your voice? <laughs> uh, it's on purpose. Anyway, um, comedy store come today. Hey, we could put you in the belly room. Oh, ain't that it? We'll talk to Michelle. Don't worry about that. That's true. That's true. Because I'm gonna tell you what. Very much could happen. I didn't even think about I'm that. I'm gonna story. tell you what. This week, I'm hosting. To hear, I know they came to you, right? But you're out of town. Uh, who? Michelle said she hit you up because I asked her to hit you up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I am out of town this weekend, though. Yeah, because I, um, basically, like, they about to give me, like, damn near, like, an hour on stage to just do a bunch of shit. Like, do my own shit. Like, just, like, flat out, like. You know, it's like, you know, it's kind of like they feel bad. And I'm like, damn, why y'all feel bad? It wasn't y'all, but you never know. Yeah. You never know what really happened, bro. So, so that's why I don't want to blame anybody. You know, I acknowledge it. I see what it is. I know how I would have played it. And that's all you really can do in a situation. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Well, enough of that, man. We about to shake it off and get started with today's episode. I uh, want to give a shout out to our special guest. We got Lulu Gonzalez in the house. We got Ty Davis in the house. Of course, we got the original squad, Mr. Pat Cloud and CP. And we're about to jump right into the first topic right after this. This podcast is sponsored by BetterHelp. Look, life can be overwhelming and many people are burnt out without even knowing it. Symptoms can include things like lack of motivation, feeling helpless or trapped, detached, fatigue, and more. And I've been burnt out myself, man. I've had a lack of motivation sometimes to just even do videos and do my own type of content because I'm just completely out of it, completely fatigued from life. I just want to lay down and sleep and do absolutely nothing. And that is not a good feeling. Sometimes we associate burnout with work, but that's not always the only cause. Any of our roles in life can lead us to feeling burnt out. And BetterHelp Online Therapy wants to remind you to prioritize yourself. 
Talking with someone can help you figure out what's causing the stress in your life. I've been in therapy for over three years and I absolutely love it. When I'm having a feeling, I can bring that to my therapist and they help me out. They help me get through things. They help me understand why I'm thinking these things or having automatic thoughts that are really bothering me. And that's why I continue to go to therapy because I need that on a daily basis. BetterHelp is customized online therapy that offers video, phone, or even live chat sessions with your therapist. So you don't have to see anyone on camera if you don't want to. It's much more affordable than in-person therapy, and you can be matched with a therapist in under 48 hours. Squadcast listeners get 10% off their first month at BetterHelp.com squad. That's BetterHelp.com slash squad. S-Q-U-A-D-D. First topic of today, we have what's worse, an unexpected FaceTime or an unexpected guest? Easy. Unexpected guess. Now, wait, I have a question. They're both it's horrible. On the, the electronic mail, it said for life. So is that part not? You say what? The electronic board say what? General? It said for life. So if you had to choose for the rest of your natural life, one or the other. Wait, you said for life? I didn't hear that part. I didn't, I didn't no, say for life. It. I just said what's worse. No, you didn't say it, but in the electronic mail, Oh no, that, the, the for life one was for the other topic time. Oh, are you talking about the email? I was, I was, so, <laughs> I was so confused. <laughs> Holy, I was like, what the hell? If I speak in early 19th century, like the electronic mail. Um, <laughs> oh, I was, I was being fancy. Okay, so the for life is for the, okay, I got yeah. it. I, I misread. There okay. you go. It's all, all right. good. <laughs> I just wanted to make, because see in the electronic mail, the way that it's showing on my no, never say that shit again. Never say electronic <laughs> mail ever again. Remove well, that. Well, that's what the E stands nah, for. This that's is not that. Bridgerton. Remove that shit from your vocabulary ASAP. <laughs> okay. But they didn't have electronic mail in the Bridgerton. But I see what you're saying. Okay. My apologies, uh, you're the great. electronic mail has been sent out with an invite for you. <laughs> it was funny I just watching y'all faces like, like electronic mail. What, what is that? Oh, it was God. funny. That, that amused me. I thought me. you okay. said I said like a robot, like a, a male robot. Uh, the thing. Electronic <laughs> mail. I was like, is oh, that new? Yeah. Elon Musk That's come funny. out with that? I ain't gonna lie though, Lulu. A lot of women got e little e electronic mails in their uh, little drawer <laughs> next to their bed. Them roses. This is my electronic mail. <laughs> why, why, why. <laughs> hey, do y'all have a rose? I sure the fuck do. You do? I do not. I uh, do. And I was just talking to somebody over the weekend. Uh, the minute that rose came out, my spidey senses got to tingling and I said, something ain't right about that device. And I just feel like Why'd about you say 10, device? Years. Cause I, I told you I'm being fancy today. Something, something ain't right about that device. Something and, ain't right um, about that device. In I about declare. 10, 15 years, that rose gonna be one of them mesothelioma late night commercials. Ah! Ah! Like, hey, I, no. I, I, I don't know why I feel like that. It like is, a lawyer? It is, like something it is right. very, it's very addicting. It is very, like, you be want to go home. I'd be like, why you want to go home so much? See? I got to go meet my rose, man. Like, I got to go. You've gone home so for your 10, rose 15 before? 10, 15 years. 10, 15 years when Lulu out here all messed up <laughs> with you it. Know what? <laughs> you see that commercial. It, it does help me. It does help me with making bad decisions. Because it, it, instead of me having to hit somebody up and be like, I mean, I'm just telling to come over. I'm like, I'm going to just go to the rose and save me some time and effort. And mm -hmm. that's decisions. smart because I do that too. Like, I'd be like, dang, I miss him. And then I rub one out and I'd be like, no, I don't. I'm like, I don't really miss him. Oh, so, yeah. All right. yeah. Yeah, women say I mean. rub one out would never get old to me. <laughs> <laughs> rub one out. Well, there, that makes more sense than us. Yeah. yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> Well, y'all are rubbing. rubbing though. It's all like rubbing. rubbing tug, rubbing tug, tug it out. Rubbing tug. Yeah, but yours is more of a like a DJ rug. Ours, <laughs> like, there's nothing well, else. Depends. There's nothing else in our life that we go like this to, and we say we're rubbing. Mm. Like, what do you even? Because some women like to rub it out, you know, like a double clicking of the mouse, and then some like the internal. So it depends on what your jam is. 
Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm more of an external rub it out kind of girl. Yeah, I don't Nobody like asked me, but I just blocked that. That's just too you gotta block that shit, Ty. Blot it. <laughs> oh. Blot that's 25 tackle. Blot it. <laughs> Why are we like this? We're childish. <laughs> what was the unexpected what was the thing? thing? What are we Unex yeah, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Uh, unexpected FaceTime, <laughs> unexpected house guests. You yeah. can't hang up on an unexpected house guest. You're right. Exactly. Right. Yes, you can. They're, they're, you cannot answer. You cannot answer. They, they, yeah, but, they but then you got to deal with not. that, though. It's almost like they're putting you in a bad position by having to lie at your own house. Yeah. That's yeah. just, that's worse. No, you no, can no, sure. at the door. Truth. If you got the, you if you got the ring. At the door, turn off lights. If you got the ring, the doorbell ring, I, you can talk through that. You just be like, hey, what up? I'm not actually home right now. I took a car to such and such. I'll be back in about six, 16 hours. And what if they're like, that car? <laughs> <laughs> no, I was like, I took a car. Like, I took an Uber. I took an Uber. Like, we see your shadow through the window. I see you. Somebody's <laughs> in there cooking. I smell food. Oh, no, nah, I just left it on. I'm simmering something. I'm simmering something. <laughs> you see I don't know. That see, you got home? That don't that sound is, like to hear. See, that huh? unexpected guest is it's more it's more intrusive for me right like you popping up at the crib like i square up <laughs> if you wanted to fight just say that you don't you know what i mean whereas the unexpected face time i could be like oh <laughs> ignore and then going by but what life. if they were the same what if door? they had to be the same amount of time though like the, the the amount of time that the guest was outside is the amount of times that they're calling you back to back like it's not mm. just one uninspected like they're as intrusive. Wait, I would still also, prefer the face time. You should have to answer one of them. Like that's the thing. You have to answer this. It shouldn't oh, be like okay. anybody <laughs> you can ignore anyway. You I would have answer to answer FaceTime because you could always get off of the FaceTime. Like, yo, I gotta go. Somebody else is calling me. My mom's calling me or something. Like, my dog is needing me or something. And you ain't even got a dog. Or you could just you could just hang up and lying. say it was technical difficulties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah you could just hang up. Be like, but oh, bringing oh, somebody into your home. house takes time. They have, you have to bring them inside and then they settle. You can't just say two things and then be like, all right, man. Like that's you, way harder to do. You got to get them out your garage. If you, if you, you answer the door the naked, job. they ain't gonna want to come in. With, so uh, that's my that's my thing. I'm swinging that thing over when that thing swing. What's up? What? What, what happened? Which, which option you, is that if for? If you answer the door naked, they ain't gonna want to come in. So I'm gonna swing that door open with that thing. I don't swing. know about that. <laughs> Some people don't have wanna boundaries be naked all the damn time. Well, yeah, well, I bet you. If I gotta vote, I'm gonna vote naked. I bet you that. <laughs> I'm saying to hear some people, some people don't have boundaries. They'll be like, "Hey, man, put that thing up and walk right past you <laughs> into your living room." <laughs> and put some clothes on, man, and walk right on by. Some people don't, you know. Yeah, tuck that dick some people grew up in naked dick. houses. Some people grew, some people grew up in naked houses. That's all. Tuck that dick tuck in, in. Don't nobody want to see that. Tuck that in. Uh, put that up, yo. Put, put your titties up. up, you know. Mm. Mm. I, I really don't like hate either me. one of them. I'm not a fan of it. <laughs> unexpected. I don't like, like either. I feel like it's it's just it's it's common courtesy to text. Can you Facetime before you just randomly Facetime somebody? Yeah. I don't do that to everybody. Certain people I know I could just Facetime. You know? Yeah, yeah. And certain people, I always like hit them with a courtesy. Like, let me, I, I would, I would Facetime you without giving you a courtesy. Like, yo, what's up? Like, I'll hit, just Facetime you. See, like, I've never talked to any of y'all on Facetime, but like, I have certain right friends now. that I know their communication. Like, I know to hear, like, to do the voice notes, right? Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. then I have a friend that only prefers to, like, they want to lay eyes on you when they're talking. Like, Corey is a we Facetime. Mm -hmm. And then, like, I have another grown girl where we just we just talk. So it's like I tailor my how I communicate with people based on you know what our thing is. That's okay. true. Because yeah. now, if a nigga person. I don't know like that Facetime me, I'll be like, like I get annoyed when yes. people call me through Instagram or Facebook. Oh. I'll be like, who, who, why are you doing this? How do you even answer who? that? It comes with like a phone call every time. Yes, yeah, it comes through like, like yeah, Snap and uh, Instagram. Even, it'll come through like a phone I call. I, my but it says, so, uh, I can get off of Instagram or call for Snapchat. I'd be like, how dare ye? <laughs> what is up with you today? 
What is what's what going is, on? What is I literally I okay, so to be fair, I did just finish binging season one and two back to back of the Bridgerton. So <laughs> She but you're not it. even committing. You just said like yay after saying like a bunch of black shit. <laughs> well, I said ye. ye. <laughs> you know, like I'm mixing it in. You know what I mean? Like sometimes I like to be fancy. You know, like I would prefer you guys refer to me as your grace. You know? Go shut the fuck up. If you, if you could. <laughs> All right, Ty. Okay. <laughs> shut the fuck up, your grace. <laughs> or my lady, you know? Bless your heart. Oh, no. Bless your heart. You need to go <laughs> watch The Wire or something. Come the fuck okay. Yeah. Yep. Exactly. Come, more. Come back. To and the roots, next time y'all see me, I'm gonna be like, "Fuck it is, dummy." Y'all gonna be like, "Whoa, it's too much." You're no, I'm like, that's what I miss. I miss you. Okay. You gonna be like, "Ew, okay. too, Then don't do us, CP. You gotta go do something. You too, First of all, that's not how we Timberly Baltimoreans don't sound like that. Timberly Baltimoreans Timberly don't sound Beats. like they don't sound like that. Y'all sound <laughs> like y'all eat mushroom sandwiches in the morning. Timberly Beats. <laughs> Extreme. Timberly Beats. Timberly Beats. Timberly Beats. Baltimoreans Beats. don't sound like that. I uh, believe you. Uh, they do. Don't sound like that. They do. No, they don't. Like it. Like it sounds different to y'all. We don't sound like that. Y'all have never heard. Me I thought I thought they I thought some of them were British. I didn't know they were from Baltimore. There's this like this fighter who's like, we do what we do. And I thought he was like, I thought he was I thought he was a British too. He's from Baltimore. <laughs> <laughs> do what Baltimore we do. is like a tiny black Switzerland that's in America. <laughs> I is don't even mostly... know what the Switzerland accent is. What yeah, what is sound it? Like? Sound like Baltimore. So <laughs> <I'm humble. laughs> no, they don't. That's how. I but then it also depends on the Baltimore part that you're in. Like I know some people that are very, very Baltimore, and then like my mother was born and raised here, but then mm -hmm. she raised us away from here, and so sometimes she'll fall back into her. Her, her accent so like if she so if she's watching a video with karen's right she'll fall back into her accent and be like girl i'm watching videos watching these kerns act up i'll be like these what she'd be like i mean karen's no you said kern you said kern so yeah how she said corn so she, but she falls right. in and out that's funny I well karen serious. and corn are different i feel like everybody okay. in baltimore must have drank the tea at the boston tea party and y'all turned into something else <laughs> I'm sick of y'all. Don't do Baltimore. Is there tea in our harbor? Next thing you know. <laughs> do what we do. <laughs> there ain't no tea in the, city, in, the, in the inner harbor. Love Baltimore. Baltimore is a city, though. Great laughing city. Always a good show in Baltimore. Let me tell you something. If you're a comedian and you come to Baltimore, Baltimore gonna let you know if you are or y'all not. They will do that. So... <laughs> I love also, my city. They gonna let you know. It's also never been a national spelling bee champion from Baltimore. First of all, I don't know if that's true. I can't confirm or deny that, but I don't like that. You need to that spell that. pencil. Pencil. Because this, because this is a city that reads. <laughs> you yeah, 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 yeah. You make him so yeah. Dutch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, that's not correct. What you mean? You just snitch? <laughs> nah, don't take that shit. Don't you sit out there and let him talk about What he had said, I'm sorry, because I'm sorry, because it was a it was a text. I was, I was it was a money call and you know I block out shenanigans when it's about the money. You were saying <laughs> <laughs> oh, why? <word. laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because this, oh, this is the CP. This is the thing that made me mad about CP. Like, I love CP so much. And literally the other day, I was on the phone call for six hours with the homie. And we was talking about so many people, like, in a good way. We was talking about shit about people, too. But we had got to a point where we was talking about CP, and we were just singing his praises. And now I got to call her back and be like, girl, let me tell you what this <laughs> motherfucker did on the podcast. He tried to say niggas from Baltimore couldn't spell, and I don't like that. Like, what you want to do, CP? You want to fight or whatever? You said what you, you want to do, do, CP? What you I want to do? Like that. Did. What you want to do? You did that was a Mountain Dew dude. That was a Mountain Dew dude. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that was a Mountain Dew dude. I did not say it like that. 
I did not say it like that. CP. What you want to do, CP? What you want to do? What you want to do? Tell your homegirl he said, Uta Snoot. <laughs> okay, so unexpected FaceTime or unexpected Let's guests. put it to a vote. Let's put it to a vote. Unexpected FaceTime, unexpected house guests. FaceTime. Unexpected FaceTime. guests. Wait. Wait, what would you worse, rather have right? it or which one which is, is worse? Which is worse? Well, yeah. Which is worse? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh, which is guess. worse? Yeah. Yes. The guests. Unexpected yes. guests. I say guests as well. Looks like the guests have it. It's unanimous. We're going to jump right into the next topic right after this. Next topic of the day we have, you have to do one for life. Indian food versus Italian food. Italian. Italian is so much. That's it's easy. easy. Spaghetti. Pizza. Yeah, Pasta. It's, it's lasagna. Delicious. But it's hella carb heavy. If you got to eat that every day, Uh-oh. you're going to be fat as hell. I, w- I, I don't run. care. I w- will do it i love me some italian food that's my favorite kind of food I, even if it's bootleg italian olive garden there's salads up, and go. there's healthy things in these things they have <laughs> there's, olives. Salad. there's healthy options ain't nobody, ain't nobody bring you a salad boy shut the fuck up <laughs> <laughs> just, you you're just me? like i had to eat pizza every single day this week it's like no you didn't <laughs> <laughs> it was required there's so much other stuff all this pizza and sausage and bread. Here we just we just accept breadsticks on the first day. Oh, this is breadsticks for the rest of my life. <laughs> you can't now, three Indian foods that you really even like that you can eat every day. Tikka masala. Well, you, now, non, uh, non bread is pretty lit. Um, the uh, curries, the the uh, I think there's green, red, and yellow. 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 They lost me yellow. at curry. I can't fuck with curry though. That, see, that's curry. the thing. Like, I like some Indian food, but it's spicy. Like, so that's why I can't do it. Because, you know, I got that. Not all of it. You know what I mean? I got the heartburn. I can't. Me too. You know. See, that's the pasta for me. The red sauce will have me up all night burping. Like, the. If but I you don't always have to get the red sauce. sauce you, like you can get. Tomato sauce? Hmm? Yeah. You said. But you can get other sauce. Red sauce, yeah. The, the tomato sauce, the tomato paste, hella acidic. That shit have me burping mm-hmm. all night if I eat it too late. Well, yeah, I can. Well, eat it early. How much sauce are you eating? But wait, now this is the one to hear. So this is the (laughs) one for life, right? Yeah. For life. For For life. life. So either you have Indian food for life, no Italian food, Mm. or you have Italian food for life, no Indian food. Right. Right. Italian food for life. I want all the Italian food. Turn up. Mm. Me too. We're going to be right next to each other. Italian and they have good product. desserts too. Oh, have y'all had some gelato? Gelato. Oh, the weed fire. or the or the gelato? <laughs> so what? Never mind. They yeah, are gelato is cool. They're both. Where does hummus good. fall? Is that uh, more Middle Eastern and Mediterranean? Mm-hmm. It's yeah, it's Mediterranean. Yeah, I feel like that. But doesn't yeah. that does? I mean, I've seen. Maybe. I, I feel. I feel like hummus would still fall under, would it? But I don't want to eat no hummus all the time. Hummus is but see, so that's the thing. Good. Like, I see hummus. It's a texture issue for me. Like, I like chickpeas, mm-hmm. but hummus, it's like I don't want it. Hey, Boris Head did come out with a hummus that was a <laughs> dessert hummus, and it was it was <laughs> pie, apple. Boris Head has a dessert hummus. They have really? uh, apple pie. Uh, pumpkin pie and another one, but them joints is slamming. Like, I, I tweeted it and they hit me back. I was like, Can you send me a case of these? <laughs> hey, hold on though. Them joints that is good. That's is the so only time bad. I eat hummus like every day. Yeah, yeah you can what make you other TV? shit with an Italian. You can make other stuff with Italian food. It's just how you say it. Like, you know, I want the beef a patty and a, and a little bread, not a burger. I want the beef a patty and a little bread. A little bread, a little bread. The beef a pie, the little bread, the little bread. You know what I'm saying? Oh, man, you got your bread. Go, go Why, that. CP? Why not? Why are you like this? Beef, 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 beef a pie, the, on the garlic bread. The garlic bread, beef a pie. The. You could probably make enchiladas and a bunch of like fire Mexican inspired dishes yeah. with Italian food in, ingredients. I thought you were going to say empanada when you said a beef patty and a bread. Yeah, right? They already have that. Make that too. <laughs> yeah. 
But I'm talking about a burger though. A beef pie, I did. <laughs> or me, no, you gotta burger. say a meatball. A meatball and a bread. A meatball and a little biscuit. A meatball biscuit. Bam. Yeah, we got you, you a motherfucker. have a meatball sub though. Look at you. Look at you thinking. Mm-hmm. Wheels turning now. Yeah. <laughs> are lighting up. Mm-hmm. I feel like I feel like I just don't know enough about Indian food to really make the the a fair comparison too, because all of the dishes that I'm looking at, looking up, I I've never had. What are some of the dishes for the sure. Indian food? Uh, name a couple. Name a couple. Vada pav, which uh-huh. is deep oh, fried delicious. dumplings and yeah, or flat fantastic. patties, which sounds good. Yeah. Uh, bahi, which is crispy, deep fried dollops of spicy chick- chickpea. Oh, yeah, I love mm. that batter served with spicy that. condiments. I'll with anything that's a dollop. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's like naan, which is fire. <laughs> see me, see me. Tikka masala, China masala. I, I just, I don't know. I don't. I just is don't that know. black China masala. No. <laughs> <laughs> what? Black China masala. I said. Lit. I said China, China masala. I should have put a gun in your throat. <laughs> <laughs> Come with a side of tiger. I don't know. Oh, wow. What? Oh wow. Hey, they in, the Indian food uh, desserts look fire. Not better than no gelatos. I'll tell Ooh, you that. Gelato is so good. Nothing. I'm going with Italian food hands down. This was yeah, I guess not even food. a question. Hold on, man. I'm trying I'm, to yep. find this restaurant that was in Japan. It was um, I cannot remember the name of it, but the shit that was, was like Indian food. Yeah, it was like an it's Indian fresh. um restaurant, but it looked like Waffle House. Like they were all over there. Like they were in Iwakana, Ikanawa, and like two other places we went to. Well, where, where, where? In Japan. Yeah, but what did you? What was the place that you said I didn't hear you? Oh, uh, the, the 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 cities we went to. Yeah, what was the name of the city you went to? Uh, Iwakuna. I mean, Iwakuna, Ikenawa. Ikenawa. Okay. Yeah. We didn't watch Karate Kid, did you? <laughs> Ikenawa. Here, no, we that's never been there. I, so he just saying, I she, never sound been there. Like, that's why I was. No, I went there. I went, it was me, Nate, and Tony. We went, we went to just, Japan. Uh, we went random, to Ikenawa. He named it random uh, Nintendo parts. The cartridge, I, up the holder <laughs> I was over there with the cartridge holder. Then I was, uh, <laughs> we spent two days in the reset button. We was over there to reset the button. <laughs> no. Why isn't that there? there should be an Indian Express, oh, right? No. Make it. Make it. I don't know enough about no, no, but it, but it, but it got to be the animal though. So it got to be like an elephant express. Oh, oh right. Okay. Okay. Right. Now get your food. I like that. Okay. Okay. Now. Okay. Okay. Now. Elephant express. You said right. okay now. Well, where is that? My my apologies. Ty. I, would, I would go my to apologies. Elephant Express. I would. I would too. Thank right. You. I picture myself there right now, ordering <laughs> stuff. Also, Ty. Some non bread. <laughs> So some China masala to go. China. Oh, they have a little, China a little commercials. My nines telling me no. <laughs> hey yo, it's an elephant signal. Nines telling me no. <laughs> but masala, masala, me yes. Shut up. That's the whole campaign right there. I'm not trying to stay my sorry. But it's something. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> oh. Nigga, if that if that was a commercial, I'm going, bro. Yeah. Hell yeah. I'm, I'm already like, there. They I'm already sold. Sold. They get it. <laughs> Y'all get them out. I'm already sold. I'm already sold. <laughs> I see nothing wrong with an acid rain flood. With some acid rain flood. <laughs> with some acid rain flood. Oh, Show us the niggas boy. just burping up blood. Bang, bang, bang. Well. <laughs> burping up blood? Nigga, that, that shit's spicy enough. Wait. I just, I, I just imagine, nigga, burp up a piece of his heart. Like, oh, this is a piece of my heart. We're going to go to the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> Give it him some oil, put it back down. <laughs> oh, they beat yeah, you. I don't know. Let's make me do that. 
I like her. So I'm a, I'm gonna I'm go with Italian. Even after the Elephant Express, that didn't sway you. Nah, man. Hey, no. we did a whole I mean, campaign. I'm the, I'm the main investor in Elephant Express. Lulu, I don't know if you heard when I said my nine selling me no. I don't know if you. That was a persuasive point. I thought the rest of us are all on board. I don't know if you. Had, you know what I'm saying? I thought you might have been persuaded. Uh, uh, I'm gonna stick with Italian, man. I'm gonna stick cool. with the Italian. Cool. I'm yeah. with you, Lulu. Italian. Made a whole campaign for y'all and we still didn't oh, sway. Soft, I, I was still invest in Elephant Express. You know, that was my prime idea. That was my investment. But I'm I'm just going, I'm going to eat somewhere else. You know? <laughs> no, soft, Wrong. Bro. I'm going Italian too. <laughs> Nobody will come to the Elephant Express. <laughs> y'all can't express y'all ice. palate. You do this in nah, the Not for a lifetime. You're not asking me lifetime. now though. I don't know enough. That's we can't expand lifetime. our what? What'd you Alex. say to here? We can't expand. Okay. Alex. That's what I said. Alex. Alex. That's Alex. Alex. I didn't Alex. hear you. That's why I was asking. You want me to say like pilot. a Baltimore person? Y'all can't expand y'all pad. Don't do that. A Pulu. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Pulu. That's not how Baltimore people talk. <laughs> a pallet. That's not how Baltimore people talk. My Pulu. <laughs> what? Why I sounded like Pop Smoke. Baltimore people talk. <laughs> okay. Pulu. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm soft man. So, All right, I think I'm gonna go see because at Elephant Express, you gotta try our all new ice cold spicy waters. Um, spicy water, spicy waters. You think it's you know, you, the, the food is spicy, you wash it down with this, and you know, what I'm saying <laughs> <laughs> it really fuck you up. So, this is something we just doing brand new spicy, spicy waters with the hot ice, a mint, and, um, a mint jalapeno splasher. <laughs> no, we, we actually have a, uh, and then we have the uh, the ghost pepper slushies that we're doing for the children. Jesus. So no, I'm going Italian, man. Fuck that. <laughs> All y'all y'all. soft, man. All y'all soft. So Ty, you so Italian? You, what, you, Lulu, you Italian? Yeah. At you Italian? I'm going to Mafia Express. <laughs> <laughs> soft, man. All right. Trade well, medicine. Trade medicine. That's a that's a <laughs> shot up lasagna with the breadsticks hanging out the side there. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like Italian has that one, and I'm going Italian too. Oh, We're gonna jump into this next <laughs> the next topic right after this. Last topic of the day, we have: Would you rather go bald or go gray? Well, that's gray. Easy. Gray. Go gray. What the fuck? See, here's here the thing. Some people got a smooth bald head and never imagine if Michael Jordan never went bald and never knew he the, he changed the lives of bald niggas all over the world. You know, some people are supposed to be bald because it means so much to the community. You know what I'm saying? Niggas like me though, I take my shit gray and then die in black. <laughs> Look, you, I, I'm a woman, I dye my hair already. Uh I have no problem with continuing with dyeing my hair for the rest of my life. But y'all could do wigs. Y'all could do so much stuff with wigs, though. I don't got a wig head. I got a real weird shaped tiny penis. Here, head. You're the worst devil's advocate ever. Well, see, I wear wigs. I don't. I don't wear full wigs. I you don't wear no wigs. wigs mostly, oh, I do wear wigs. Okay. Yeah. I wear wigs. You, it's not a wig. Uh, CP, the last time I saw you in person, I had a wig on. Did you? I'm not yep. good at that. I'm not good at noticing. Well, wigs to be right fair, now. my wigs are high quality and they look very nice. <laughs> No, to be fair, women always know. Women will fuck up like, mm. like my wife be like, wig, wig, no, wig. Some chicks, track, I can't wig. tell who got women a wig. No, I don't be knowing that shit. Some no, sometimes you can't tell. Wigs. Yeah, like I don't like, I, I don't do the full uh, lace front, like mm-hmm. where they have to, you know, the screen door and you have to blend it in and then do the That's baby hair. Mm-hmm. That's not my jam. Say, I don't. The screen yeah. door. The well, screen it looks like a screen door. The looks lace like a screen front. <laughs> That's the part that they cut off and, and they- you know yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, Ty, yeah, hey, Ty, yeah, yeah. you know what? We, from now on, let's start calling that mesh. <laughs> let's start calling that mesh from now on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it is called, it is called that's mesh. Mesh, you're right. Mesh. But what I'm saying is it's the, it's the, the, and it's got the little square. And then because if some, because if you don't do it right, that's why some people put makeup, you gotta put the makeup so it can match your scalp. You know, you, you've seen people out where they've had on a wig and it might look nice, but then it's like, why they got white people's scalp, but they black girl? That's yeah. that That's that mesh, you see. That should be meshed up. Screen door. Right, it be meshed up. 
Yeah. But CP, you got I like him being weird. You you both got full head of hair. Like if yeah, like mm-hmm. what if you if you if it starts okay, to hang time, are you gonna go bald? Or are mm-hmm. you gonna go get a weave? Um it depends on how my bald head look. Did that motherfucker a little sweet, which I don't see that's the does. thing. You don't like it. You don't like it. I don't think it do. You don't like I've it. I've been I wanting to shave look, my head. Little and evil. You say what? For the, like for the past few months, I've really been wanting to like shave my head. But the only reason I haven't done it is because I don't know what the shape of my head is, mm-hmm. and I won't know unless I shave it up. So what if I shave my head and then I got like? Do you remember that show that used to come on Alien? What if I got the long hook head? What if what if I got the hook head? And now I don't look good as a baldy. Why do you want to shave your head though? Perfect, People who got that hook head, I imagine them sleeping in the closet on the rack. Just ridiculous. I always see people don't get, their mother they mold their head right. That's all that is. Like do your Stop mother ain't love you enough. Do you want to cut it all the way head off? Head uh, right. Had you been thinking about cutting it all the way off or just shaving it down? Not like bald skin bald, but like. You know, low, like low. Like, like Grace I Jones? Guess, do y'all call it a fade? Do y'all call it a, like, turn to the side to here? Like Grace Jones. Like, she Grace Jones. Yeah, like, you know, like the low part where your, where your, uh, your glasses is, like, you mm-hmm. two CP, like how y'all got it close on the side, like that low. Turn mm-hmm. to the side to here. That low. I don't like, know why you got like a Fila outfit right now. Like, what? A feeler outfit. We turned to the side. You just remind me of a feeler outfit. Like you may want to get a velour feeler outfit, like a blue and navy blue with a feeler on it. You How? remind me of a feeler outfit. How did man. that even come you up? You remind me of a the, the, right here look like an F and it looked like the symbol from feeler. Something about you, man. Made me want to go Google where I can get me a feeler outfit from. So, so I I shaved my head. I was bald a couple times. You went really? bald before? I, yeah, I wanted to see what I was like, gonna look like bald. Now, so. was it like skin bald or was it like, bald, like a little bit of razor. Oh, wow. I've never seen that. You have a picture? Yeah, I'm gonna that's pull it like, that's yeah. like That's like wrinkling Find your skin up to see how you're gonna look when you're old. Like, nigga, that's none of your business until you get there. <laughs> I wanted to see, nigga. So I did it. Let me see if I can find But it. here's the thing about gray hair, because I've, I've been going gray for a while, like my late 20s, but if I were to, my problem with gray is how it staggers in. Like if I went to sleep tonight and woke up, we given full storm from X-Men, turn up. I'm here for that. But that one errant gray hair here and there, no. I, I would like to go gray all at one time. If I went gray all at once, I'd keep it. Yeah, that's another thing. It, it ain't no guarantee your, all your hair is going to turn gray. It might just be patches. Mm-hmm. Somebody got to scare the shit out of you for all your hair to turn gray at the same time. <laughs> what do you think it's a Scooby Doo? Somebody got to be <laughs> like, you thought you was alone, then you be like, ah! You hear gray, that ball turn gray. But she'd be crazy. Reason, I don't think that's this. how it works, but uh, you know, bless your heart. Yeah, I don't think that happens. <laughs> that's right. how they do it. The, didn't that happen on Candyman? In the I was about to say that happened Candyman, on Candyman. Somebody saw them and they went all the way. Yeah. yeah they went all the way. Yeah. You know how they shocked their system. All that stress, mm-hmm. that shit went gray. That's crazy. <laughs> I'm telling you, somebody got scared the shit out of you. Somebody got. I'm telling you, I think I think the the top five scared the shit out of you got to be like a, like a funeral prank where you really thought somebody died. You've been mourning the whole week, and then you get up to the beauty body. They like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Nah, oh. see, that ain't cool. That'll That's fuck not you cool up. Yeah, <laughs> they got to do crazy. That even, ah! you know what I'm saying? They got to do that. <laughs> Or, <laughs> or why does your brain work like that? Well, why did you have that on deck though? Because I feel like you've been waiting to do that to somebody. No, nah, because that's my that's that's one of my biggest fears. That's 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 why I know it would turn my hair Tell white. me more. <laughs> if I if I got to a motherfucking funeral with somebody who I thought was dead, and then I, I go to reach down and get him a message like I'm always love you, and they like you too. <laughs> See, I gotta <laughs> like, add that. Ah! I got to add that to the yeah. list of conversations we need to have offline, CP, because we need to talk about that shit you said about the bees the last time I was going. I got the call. You got to talk about that shit. What I say about the uh, bees? You, hey, man, you, you said what you used to do to bees when you was little, and I was like, we should probably talk yeah, about that. Yeah, let's pull their wings off, turn them into big mega ants. They look just like ants without the wings. And I did also to humble them niggas a little bit like, nigga, you are not that far removed 
from living in the hill. You got a hive now. You living in the hive, but you was just. I'm gonna in the call hill. you. We need to unpack that. Okay, <laughs> we I, need to know, unpack that. But listen, okay. but listen. Back to what I was saying though. That's that's me with locks. Oh that's man, I thought, that, I thought that was a bitch. Wow, you had locks. You look like you look like you sell T-Mobile. Go back to that picture. Oh man. Big hair. Wow. He had Big a hair. lot of locks, nigga. You like a baby dinosaur with all them locks. Big hair. Yeah. Fuck you mean. We out here, my nigga. A baby Oh, predator. wow. Jesus Big Christ, you had hell wow. And then this is me ball. I don't Yo, like no, it. No, you like a way. fucking professor. You like, like a professor. Like uh, you like, like a professor at one of them small I colleges. Out here. Oh, head uh, tilted. What's up? Yeah, you ain't like it. Wearing your hair like what your, your hair it's, like it's, that. I don't like you, that. <laughs> it's giving gangbanger. Is that Terrence Delane? You know why? Because it, it, it's all just one solid note. There's no different color change. Yeah, your forehead <laughs> just 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 touched the back of your neck. Yeah, it's like the eyebrows is right. My head goes like. I don't Who's have the, the that black nigga. You look like an adult golden retriever. Uh, Why was that picture of CeeLo? Fuck Lulu. Dang. <laughs> what do you say? What do you say? Wait, I wait. say he look like an adult golden retriever because <laughs> that was a lot. <laughs> because you know how golden retrievers are all just one color? Like their eyebrows is gold, everything is just gold. And you'd be like, where is this beginning and end? And he's like, oh, I thought we were going? friends. What the fuck is that? I do. From? That's why I don't like you being bald. I don't want you to be bald no yeah, more. Yeah, so I, I, I agree with that. I don't, Old I don't want retrievers that look like a big ass cornflake to me. Or like a piece of fried chicken. You know that you take the piece that's, off that's just the skin that's, that's really that's, fried that's, really that's, hard. That's, I get I get it. Don't go bald. I got it. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank yes, just one note. You need you need a color buffer. <laughs> yeah, to hear you know, I ain't never, I ain't never went bald on purpose, man. That's something, man. You know, I just want to see what it looked like. But you're lucky; you could do that and then grow back healthy, and 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 you still have your hairline. Bless, bless. I could, that's, that's that's all I can say. Bless. Damn. What? I could see y'all being full gray, but like jazzy. Like, yeah, I would take like a, I wish I could get like just a streak if it happens, just like one streak this way. Nigga, gray braids, I kill hey, myself. Like stunk? Gray braids. You wouldn't have gray braids? Hell no, what nigga? That's but like, like your hair's still full. Hey, it's everybody, still I got the ribs. The ribs be done in twenty minutes. Everybody, <laughs> get ready for the ribs. Not like a skunk, Todd Davis. Just like a like an accent piece. Why the fuck would you just go straight to a skunk? That's it. Well, I didn't want to say Cruella DeVille because that's a girl. That's a who? But also, that's Cruella a had half gray, half it's black. It's a girl. It, it wasn't sprinkled in. It's a girl. Yeah. It's a girl. It's a yeah. human girl. Yeah. Evidently, the way and they I think that's why I didn't want to give him a girl. And for the finals in the 1999 the International Spelling Bee champion. Tired Give me a from... word to spell, CP. Give me a word. And Give to hear, I don't like how you have my back on this, because I spelled a hard word on you, and that was before spelling is hard was out. You know I can spell to hear. Give me a word, CP. Let's go. Let's the go. Word Give me a word. Oots. I'll spell it right now. The word is oots and snitch. The origin <laughs> is Baltimore. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to use it a sentence, please? You got to use this with the pencil. <laughs> All right, I'll give you a word. You get right on now, my nerves. <laughs> I'll give you, you a word. Nerves, right you get on my nerves, CB. Okay. All right, give me a word here. Okay. Uh, uh, you got Mr. Word in his heart. Ooh. Handkerchief. First of all, that's easy. You're being disrespectful. That's easy. Well, you gotta give it. a different Shit. word. It's it's all the it's one of it's one of the list no. of comedy misspelled words. So I just want to make sure you don't spell it right. Okay, handkerchief. H A N K E R C H I E F. Handkerchief. That is incorrect. H A N D. There's a D in handkerchief. 
First of all, no, there's not. You said no, hanker. You didn't say handkerchief. She know what it is. Right. I got to She know what a handkerchief no, you, is. No, you said handkerchief. You didn't I, say handkerchief. You got it wrong. You got Everyone it wrong. No, 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 that's it's not it's one handkerchief. handkerchief. <laughs> you only smell it, CP. You, you can, you looking it up. You looking it up. I see. I'm not looking up anything. I'm not looking up anything. You definitely looked it up, CP. I did not look it up. You We're talking about it. the phone is over here. What do you want right now? My no, but what's, what's the camera from? It's a laptop, right? All right, Ty, I'll give you, what do you, Ty, I'll give you, on you your one laptop. more. Ty, I'll give you one more. All right. A current. Professional. You said what? A current. A current. Man, I hate that stupid ass word, bro. Oh. God, I hate that word oh, so much. Oh, oh. Yo, I hate that word. All right, all right. Two Ts and two Rs, okay? Okay, okay, Ty. Okay, Ty, spell February. <laughs> F-E-B-R-U-A-R-Y. Thank you, you are, you know what I'm saying? It's February, February, F-E-B-R-U-A-R-Y. That is incorrect. If you that is not incorrect. The origin from, for the Baltimore spelling is F-E-B-R-U-A-R-Y. R U R Y. February. February. Why are you why are you making me sound like Sylvester Stallone and Rocky? Right? <laughs> February. Well, nah, but for real. But, but for real. Is Hank is handkerchief spelled with a D? Yeah. So handkerchief with a D. Is it? Yes. I ain't know it that. is. It's handkerchief. Handkerchief. It's not handkerchief. You Hanker. said handkerchief. Lulu, don't try to get. Yeah, don't try to be an escape girl. Don't don't give no no excuses why she spelled the wrong. She you did say I, I, handkerchief. I don't I don't I don't I don't like how motherfucking stupid I'm about to look. I feel like we should do this whole episode again. <laughs> Keenan, take this out. system. <laughs> <laughs> what about occurrence? Ty, do you want to try your? Try and here's the thing. Occurrence? I didn't I didn't go to. Oh man, I hate that word so much. Because I used to get so many when I had a job. That's why I got fired, bro. Okay. A current. I feel like mm -hmm. I'm wrong. Go ahead, give it but I'm going for it. Man, is it two C's? I don't know. One Maybe C. three. Okay, I know for sure it's an O. Uh, on behalf of the city of Baltimore, I would like to go on record and say that I only went to public school, uh, Pasico 163 for one year. Uh, the majority of my tutelage did take place in Fayetteville, North Carolina, with the exception of Germany. So Baltimore is not responsible for this incorrect You're answer. Stalling. So I'll go O-C-C-U-R-R-E-N-C-E. -E. Correct. Uh... <laughs> Uh, 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 I don't think that you guy do like good that. tourist kids. But I don't want, I don't, but, but Baltimore is not responsible for me spelling handkerchief wrong, is what I'm trying to say. I only went to one Baltimore public school one year. So then Baltimore what's really said. snitching? What, like, what's really snitching? If we're just itching, why, then, if we're going to Why are we doing this? If we're itching, then why yeah. are we not, what's really snitching? Why are you like this, CP? At the end of the day, <laughs> at the end of the day, but what was snitching? Young bull? Put that on a t -shirt. First of all, bull is Philly. That's not Baltimore. Okay, yeah, bull, bull is Philly. Bull is dummy? Philly. We, what they say, we got dummy? yo. What they say, dummy? <laughs> we got yo. They say we got stupid. yo. Dummy is kind of new, but we got yo's and dummy. Yo. You yo, stupid. what are you snitching, dummy? You're not That's cool. Nobody talks <laughs> like this here, CP. That sounds like an IKEA brand deal to me. Yeah, what's the let's put it to a vote? Go ball. What's the, go what's the vote? What what we what we talk about? I'm gonna take Baltimore. Ah, that's what we're doing. Oh wait, what's I'm the vote again? Go ball <laughs> versus go gray. Yeah, I'm gonna go ball the more. So no, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna go gray. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna go gray. <laughs> I'm going gray. I'm going ball. What you doing to here? You going ball for life? Me, really? For life? Yeah. For life? He just told you we not like that. Listen, bro, you, you can cut your hair short as hell. All right, it's cool. You do do what you want to do to here. I just I, I just wish people would respect I'm a, I'm they, they hairlines while they here. The tattoo, the tattoo hair. 
Like how they. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna just get you a red collar so we yeah. can find your ass when you go out in the street. <laughs> So you don't get lost. I want to thank Play our special crappy. guest Ty Davis and Lulu Gonzalez for jumping in with us today. Uh, shout out from the original squad. It's me, CP, Pat Cloud. Had to hop off a little early. Thank y'all so much for watching another episode of Squadcast hey. Versus. We'll see y'all next week. You're the golden <laughs> Tahiver. Get off. Get off. <laughs>